Keys in another room. Grab them so we can get the hell out of here. Still not sure about leaving him like this. He came through with the truck just like we asked. He greased his partner to make it look good. But if you got that, I'll take the chance. Oh! <laughs> All right then, that's that. Goddamn. <laughs> Keys. Lincoln, pick up the keys. We should get going. You got the keys so you can drive. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. Woo! Goddamn! That gets me every time. You get a move on. Let's go. Take it easy here in the town. We don't need the cops crawling up our asses. My old man wanted us to keep one of the guards alive, help throw the feds off the trail. Like you said, I'll take a chance. Besides, if I learn anything from being over in Nam, someone's willing to flip sides once, they're probably willing to do it a second time. Fuck you in the process. So answer me this. What's the craziest thing you saw over there? You don't want to know. Hell, man, I'm a taxpayer. I got the right to know how my money's being spent. Oh, Georgie Marcano pays taxes. Damn right I do. That's how they got Al Capone, and I ain't going to prison for no fucking tax bill. Huh? So come on, you gonna answer the question or what? We, uh... We on the coast of Quang Nai. Evacuating the civvies for Charlie overran everything. Anyway, we getting them onto a medical ship. And this woman walks up. She's got a baby in one hand and the leash to a pig in the other. She starts up the ramp, and the MP stops her and tells her, you can only bring one thing on board. So she tosses the baby into the water. MP goes ape. Tells someone, dive in after the kid, starts screaming at the woman, wants to know what the fuck she's thinking. You know what she says to him? She says, I can always have another baby. Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, man, you asked. <laughs> yeah, but I thought you were going to tell me a story about some gook getting his dick blown off or something. I mean, god damn. It's not a fault. But not like you think. The conditions over there, man. Jesus Christ. One day you're raising cattle, tending your rice. Next day everything bombed flat. You put people up against the wall, they will do anything to survive. That better have been one delicious fucking pig.
Dodge at the reserve probably won't be too keen on you waltzing around with that piece of yours. I'll just leave it under the seat. to see if these forged IDs are worth a fuck. When I say something about being hot, that's when we make our move. All right. Here we go. Put your IDs up to the glass. We're part of the Boeing crew. What the fuck's this shit heel doing here? Affirmative action. You know how it is. Old country is spinning around a goddamn toilet. You can follow me. As for you, go on and grab those bags off the truck. You'll be carrying them to the burn room. How much y'all bring in? $238,546. Small bills, mostly. I'll let Miss Gale call up your office when we're done. She'll confirm the delivery. Appreciate it. You need to check that scattergun. You packing anything? Still in training. Good. One less goddamn thing for me to worry about. You can pick it up on the way out. Buying room's down in the cellar. This way. I ain't seen y'all around these parts before. Y'all was over in Georgia for a while. He just got out the service. And my cousin's been trying to get on here for over a year now. Was in the Navy for two tours, got medals falling out of his ass. Government tells him thanks, but no thanks. That's a crock of shit if I ever heard one. Sad day when a God-fearing white man can't get a job, but ain't your nigga who staggers in his hide on the spot. These bastards better not be playing with each other back there. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you! Christ, look at that. Didn't know y'all held that much gold. That Washington's been shuffling around on account of the war. It's here, then it gets sent to Dallas, then it comes back. And it doesn't make a lick of goddamn sense. Here we are. Those bags on the table there. Never done this detail before. Figured it'd be bigger. It gets the job done. Only time there's a problem is when the flu clogs up. Fuck. That's some heat right there. You used to use coal for it, but you. Ah! God, that guy was an asshole. We need to move. Danny and Ellis should be coming up any time now. Now right, give me a second. You take care of those guards. Keep your ass down. You don't want them getting a drop on us. I know what the fuck I'm doing. You know that house we've been renting out? Called over there last night. Told them I wanted to sell it. Told them Ugh. I needed to be out in two weeks. And the man, uh, John, starts laying into me. Saying the lease gives them the right to a 30-day notice. I found him! Ugh. Ugh. Come on, we need to get this vault open. Jesus Christ, it's a fucking robbery! I'm going for help! How about we finish this? There he is! Let's go! Need to get the hospital! Oh, Son of a bitch! Don't walk me dead! What's he think he's doing? Go! 
got him! Back me up here! Let's get those cocksuckers! Take this from here! Don't kick the hornet's nest this time. Only way we walk out of here is if we get the weapons stored in that armory. Bust the door open. I'll watch our ass. Help me out. My old man gonna shit a brick when he hears about this. Fuck! Fuck! Come on, help it! Give me that damn thing. Face way worse than this over in Nam. Little smoke don't mean shit. Stay close to the vault, watch for the drill. I'll deal with these assholes. He crazier than a shit house rat. Here he is. Well, Sammy had men all over the place. And one of them worked at a cleaner's.
Huh? So Sammy's doing all right. Ever since we got your telegram about coming home, he's been climbing the walls. What if the plane crashes? What if the train's delayed? What if they call him back? And he goes stand in front of the kitchen window and sip his whiskey like he was expecting you to come strolling up the sidewalk. Don't say nothing about me telling you that. I won't. He'll be fine once he sees you. Ever since Mama Hell, you know how he gets. Remember Marty and Ron Langford? Sure. They moved up to Empire Bay a year or so after you shipped out. Started selling weed. They call and ask me if I want some. I say, sure. It's free money as far as I'm concerned. Anyhow, a month back, Marty drops me a line and says they're moving into heroin, that they're looking for a partner down around these parts. Can't imagine Sammy was too keen on that. I never told him about the weed. That ain't nothing to nobody. But this, I got to talk to him about. I ain't said more than three words, and he's yelling about the feds. How we don't need J. Edgar up our asses, and what the fuck am I thinking? Selling dope with kids running around the neighborhood. We ain't selling no dope to no children. <laughs> like they got any money to begin with. <laughs> Fucking around aside, Aaron was pretty serious shit. Knew a couple guys over in Nam who were running it. Wound up pissing off the wrong person. Got their throats cut. Shit, man, I know what... Shit! Watch what you're doing! Anyway, shit, man, I know what's what. That's why I'm talking to Georgie about it. There's no way Sal's gonna go along with that. Georgie says he can keep his old man from fighting out. We are still clear of the high low in Frisco, just selling the French wall. Georgie's Uncle Lou won't say shit as long as we give him a taste of the action. I don't know, man. Georgie's a cool cat and all, but heroin ain't the kiddie pool. Come in on it with us. I bet he'd agree to a three-way split. <sighs> I don't know. I kind of need to lay low a bit, figure some things out. Yeah. All right. Once you get settled in, I was thinking we could go to this new club in the French Ward. Maybe double dating. Well, who the hell am I gonna go with? Your great Aunt Beatrice? Oh, God. <laughs> I ever tell you I accidentally saw her without a shirt once? Oof. That woman has the droopiest, nastiest tits I've ever seen. <laughs> they were like two sacks of potatoes with nothing in them. Yeah, like that was a fucking accident. Hey, man, fuck you. I was damn lucky to walk away from that. Come on, we're going through the front. I ain't having your wall here. I ask you to back door. Look who I...
Barely. You go out there, what will they have you doing? Well, then most likely. Three month apprenticeship to start, then the union lets you in. You tell Sammy and Ellis? Not yet. I'm gonna wait a few days. Didn't want to spring it on them since I just got back. Well, they won't like the head, but they'll come around. You need to do what's best for you. Go ahead and start serving those folks. I'll be back. Give Sammy my best, Lincoln. Yes, sir. Huh? Warm meal, warm heart. Oh, sure. Sure. Thanks. Nice to see you. You delivering a real blessing here, Lincoln. Thank you. Blessing's mine, ma'am. Couple of days back and they already got you working? Ah, I'm happy to do it. Means a hell of a lot to all of us. Don't get old, son. It's a fucking shit show. <laughs> I'll see what I can do about that. Hey there, Lincoln. How are you, Regine? I'm good. Nice to see you around the holler again. Nice to see those big brown eyes again. Well, they'll be over at my aunt's place with the rest of me. You should stop by. Maybe I'll do that. Lincoln, we got trouble! Run, Regine! Go, go, go! Once we're go, done go, with go, you, go, Lincoln! Go, Sammy, next! Run oh, oh, for your eyes! Oh, oh. Oh, motherfuckers over here! You show this is how you want to play this. Last thing they're gonna expect is an attack from the water. You head back round to the row. Stay with the car. I'll meet you over there when this is done. Hope you know what you're doing. Trust me, Ellis. Here in a bit, this will all be behind us.
Morales. Papa Legba, open the gate for me. Him, Ellis, and the other one. Lincoln Clay. He's the one. This time he won't get away from us. Should have killed that old man a long time ago. Think the boss was worried Sammy didn't fall my Kanu. Ask him to come down on us. That cracker asshole don't give a shit about some worn out nigga. Long as the money's coming in, my Kanu don't care who's handing it to him. something odd. Petit pour mama, do do petit pour mama. Si bébé pas do do, grand loulou va manger. Grand loulou. I heard something I don't like. Si bébé pas do do, grand loulou va manger. Shit. Oh, 
I see. I'll take it. That he was here, but no more. Way. Get eyes over there. We ain't stopping till we find you, bruh! Out of bullets! Go <sighs> Thank Christ he's gone. Way. Get eyes over there. Let's pick a new spot. Huh? Holy shit! Got a body here. I'll put one in his ear! Let me at this fucker. He's empty. Take him down. Hunter bullets. Go to reload. We lose the numbers. Can't take much more. Like he's gone, so I'd call this a win. Should have killed me when you had a asshole! First I kill you, then I kill that useless old man. He's coming this way. Two eight! Sammy's boys in there! Kill him! Dead mother has a ring here! Burn him! Keep him low!
I see him! Oh, I'm fucking empty! You got it. your guns! There! I found him, motherfucker! I'm taking cover! Queen must have escaped. How are you doing? We ain't stopping till we find you, bruh! Don't think about it! Shoot him! Mind, motherfucker! Most are scared that deer here. No! 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 Don't think about it! Shoot him! Queen must have scared that piece. Now where did you go? God damn it. Find this out. It is getting goddamn ridiculous.
gotta get you out of trouble, don't I? You old? I am. How'd it go with Baka? Well, we came to an understanding. He stayed dead, and I'd let him. Let's get back to Sammy's. Can't even tell you how happy Pops is gonna be. Man, this shit with the Haitians has been weighing on him. With them out of the way, things will calm down. Go back to how they should be. Been telling him for months we needed to do something like this, but Pops, he... I don't know. Sometimes I think he's lost the taste for this shit. Just because a man don't rush to violence don't mean he lost something. I know, just makes me wonder what happens after, you know? No, I don't know. Explain it to me. Don't matter if it's a bullet or the hand of God. We all go sometime, right? I suppose. But Ellis, we don't need to talk about... I pray that Pops outlives the both of us. But if he doesn't, every motherfucker in the hollow is going to be looking to us or gunning for us. Just saying we got to be ready when that day comes. Yeah, well, that's not something we got to worry about right now. So just cool it with your grand plans, all right? Yeah, all right. Bang, Lankin did.
the fuck you doing up here? Help goes into the back. I'm, uh, I'm here to see Mr. Marcano. The name's Lincoln Clay. That a fact? I'll be goddamned. Mind your manners while you're in there, boy. Or there'll be hell to pay, you hear? Park over to the side. Somehow. <coughs> I say we Need keep looking. Stay, Stay cool. Somewhere. We'll get through this. Let's just keep looking. <coughs> Motherfuckers! You got so long. Piece of shit drill cap overheating. You and Lincoln both still in one piece? Yeah, we good. Where's Danny? He's pushing everything off to the side so that we have room to catch the money. All right, well, once you square the way up here, we start driving it down. We'll make it quick. Motherfuckers killed the lights. Just worry about the money. I'll deal with this. Trying to flush us out. Stay focused on what you're doing. Help me out. Ah, yeah, some bitch. There he is. Get up. Lock this place down. Taking cover. Shit, need more ammo. Got another man down. This is a gun. Got another man down. Comes. Shit, I I'm taking cover. Get me out of here! Goddamn massacre! Oh, I'm bad. Oh, down. I got the shot! Want some more? This is a goddamn massacre! Taking cover! Damn it, those guards will cut us down the second we make a break for it. Tell Danny he needs to get us out of here. And these bastards got us pinned down. Y'all need to figure something out. I got some TNT. I'll put on our side of the hole and detonate it. What the fuck is that gonna accomplish? With any luck, it'll blow a hole big enough for y'all to drop down. With any luck, Danny, do you even know what the fuck you're doing? Come on, it's dynamite. How complicated could it be? It's lit. Get the fuck away from the hole. Oh! 
God, get it off, Malice! I'm trying! Danny's leg is pinned! I need your help! No one really... Is everyone in? We need to go! We're all here! Go! Holy! Guards coming down through the hall! Fuck! More guards! We need to get the fuck out of here! Motherfuckers! Cops cutting off our escape route! We'll find another way out of here. This tunnel has to go somewhere. Is everyone in? We need to go! We're all here! Go! Hold ass! Ah. Guards coming down through the hall! Fuck! More guards! We need to get the fuck oh. out of here! Motherfuckers! Cops cutting off our escape route! We'll find another way out of here. This tunnel has to go somewhere. Look at the titties on her. Hey, darling, you looking for a good time? Danny, keep it down. No, actually, you get a look at the titties? I mean, God damn. Damn it, shut your mouth before you get us arrested. Stop, God damn it, stop. Fuck you, pig. Hey, man. Get off the phone. Right fucking Hell now. You dumb ass. Oh, I will not be treated in such a manner. Y'all keep an eye out. We're in some deep shit and need your help. Where are you? Just off the parade route. Danny's hurt. I can't get a car to you because the road 
Guards are closed off. Listen, there's a grocery store on the back side of the cemetery. Can you get over there? Yeah. There'll be a car waiting at the loading dock. And Lincoln, be careful, yeah? You and Ellie Sport. We will. Sammy's having a car delivered. It'll be at the loading dock at the grocery store. God bless the old man. Let's go. Look out. I apologize. I ought to smack your bottom. Drunk ass in a ditch. No, oh, God. Don't fucking waste it. Do not fucking move. <laughs> Somewhere. Let's just keep looking. Every police officer is bad, but unless the bad ones are sifted out and removed, how can we possibly begin to tell the difference between them? Yeah. All units, negative visual on suspect. Repeat, visual contact lost. somewhere. Let's just keep looking. No sign here. Let's check over there. Guys, he ain't here. Let's try there. All units, search is called off. Repeat, abandon search. Return to patrol. You're right behind us! 
Officers investigating. Responding unit. Visual contact with suspect lost. Oh, we managed to get out of this. I'm sleeping on a bed of titties. I don't care what the fuck it costs. They go? Yeah, yeah, man, they done. I knew we could pull it off, I knew it! We're rich, fuck! <laughs> I'm robbing people with a six gun. I fought the law, and the law can kiss my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I fought the law, and the law lost. <laughs> Lincoln, over here. Padre doesn't seem too keen on the plan. You don't need to worry about him. I'd just hate to encounter any of that Catholic guilt I'm always hearing about. He knows every low-life thing I've ever done and has never ratted me out. If I say we can trust him, we can trust him. Fair enough. So you mind telling me what we're really doing? We're gonna kill Marcano and all the assholes who work for him. Bullshit. If that's all you're after, you'd grab an XM-21, smear on some face paint, and they'd all be dead before dinner. And you sure as hell wouldn't need a tack up center and all this other shit you've asked me for. After I got back, Marcano offered me the holler, said it was time for Sammy to retire. I told him no. 
So you think what happened is your fault? Hard to see it otherwise. What do you think Sal was going to do? Host a little party for Sammy? Maybe give him a gold watch and a plaque congratulating him on his retirement? We both know there's only one way out of the life. And you still haven't answered my question. I'm gonna take over the city, district by district. Volcano wanted me to run the hollow? Fuck him. By the time I'm done, I'll be running the whole goddamn city. <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Assuming, of course, you're up for something that strenuous. Why the fuck wouldn't I be? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because you got shot in the face? I might have lost a step or two, but it'll come back to me. Always does. God, if that isn't the fucking truth. One other thing. Probably not much of a surprise, but most of the cops in this town are in Sal's pocket. Yeah, I don't always assume that. Just being diligent. The cops see you fighting Sal's goons. They're coming after you, every time. Sure you don't need a ride? Nah, man, I'm good. I'll be at the motel. Come see me when you're ready. Welcome home, son. Now who wants to get shit faced? Hey, bullshit they are. This goes a beast. I want you to run the hollow. <laughs>
Please excuse me. I can feel it, Alan. This is where they buried me. 200 years ago. Heard they're flying James L. Ray back hey, this hey. week. How you doing? Still amazes me they expect us to believe it was one man who did end up the king. It's too easy. Too bad. Let's say he was the one who shot Dr. King. Just him and no one else. What if it's really that easy to strike down a great man like Dr. King, President Kennedy, Brother Malcolm? Then nothing in this country will ever change. Now you struggle and you sweat and someone can take it all away just like that, huh? Dixie out of the hollow. Give me your boss and I'll make it happen. Fuck. Shit. Get to the voodoo shop. You'll find the boss there. Sorry about the headache, brother. Be bad. This happens too often. Maybe I should leave him alone. Huh? That's my only one smile. Definitely up to something. Jackie, what the hell? 
Why are you driving around in a truck? What happened to you? Sure. Government shut me down. They don't want niggas buying guns. Where are we gonna start shooting the hell out of white folks or some such? Motherfuckers. Tell me about it. Let me know if you see something you want. Lincoln, you a sight for so eyes. Laveau, been a while. Wasn't expecting to see you working with the Haitians. It's either this or bow down to them fucking coon asses, and you know I ain't ever been one to bow down to anyone. <laughs> ain't that the goddamn truth? Cassandra phoned ahead. Say you going out to Perlis. Asshole named Merle Jackson runs it. Turned it into a brothel. Let's white fellas come in and do whatever they want to our young sisters. How do I get to them? You don't. Not yet, anyway. A lot of those Dixie fucks try to stay out of sight. There's someone put a bullet up their ass. If I hit his operations, he'll have to come out and deal with me. I got an idea how to get his attention. He got some girls locked up on the second floor of Perlis. Calls them his thoroughbreds. Has them strung out on all kind of shit. He makes a lot of money off them. Go in there quiet. Get them out of there. I'll let you know when it's done. Hey, uh, I'm sorry to hear about Sammy Nellis. They always did right by me.
Take a walk. Look out! Ah, watch it! No reason to go looking for trouble. Help! Got one over what here, boys! Ducking down! Come at him from the other side. <clears throat> Shit, yeah! Run that motherfucker out of here. Ready to hit him. I see him! We've been looking. Hey boys, we can't take much more of this. We will find you, cocksucker. Believe that. Spread the word. Any woman needing help should go to the pierced heart. 
Thank, thank you. I want it all, and then some, sugar. Oh. I gotta search all night, that boy's mine. Better you than me, buddy. I take point. Like the good book says, but here we square off here and now. That baby's all mine. Got past every single one of us? Jesus. Sucker, believe that. Oh, just lost a man. Oh, oh. Is that you, asshole? Run that motherfucker out. I found him. Come on. where he is, then fuck it. Fucker must have took a cocksucker done rabbited.
Bulls body train. Dog, I can't wait. Look out! Hey! I got a little something for you. You've been running around. so much out there, I figured I'd make your life a little easier. You can use this to call on your support. And here I was thinking you were a heartless asshole. Mm, jury's still out on that one. <laughs> 